Hello everyone, today I am at the Kaguya-sama Love is War Cafe. This is in the middle of Akihabara uh, at the Princess Cafe. The cafe is actually really tiny. There's only two tables, uh, enough room for six people at a time. Luckily, I came in without a reservation and could just sit right down, so pretty happy about that. Anyway, let's take a look at the food and drinks that you can get. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a food item since I have not eaten breakfast quite yet. And I'm definitely thinking about getting this little cute bento right here. So some of the drinks are based after some of the characters in the show. For example, this one is definitely um, representative of Chica here. And this one is Kaguya's drink. Um, it's strawberry... And this is like a shortcake ice cream. That seems really good, but I don't think I'm gonna get a drink. I might just get water um, and get this right here because I'm more hungry than thirsty. I love that um, Yuki's is actually a mango drink. Um, and then some of the side characters who I don't exactly remember all the names of have also very interesting drinks. For example, this one is basically cola with chocolate with cream on top and then a niboshi. Uh, a niboshi is basically a dried up fish snack. I have tried them before. I do not like them. <laughs> so the food and the drinks come with coasters. It comes with a random character. I'm really pulling for Chica. Chica is probably my favorite character, but we will see which one I get. So on the last page of the menu, you can kind of see the exclusive items that they have for sale through the cafe, which actually right behind me is the shop. We'll definitely take a look at that later. But yeah, here's some of the things that you can buy here at the cafe. Okay, so I just ordered. Unfortunately, they were out of the bento, so I went with the ramen instead, which honestly still looks really good. So I'm pretty excited to try that. And of course, we will get a free coaster. So here's the ramen that arrived. I will uh, eat a little bit of it and I will let you know what I think about it. All right, now that I've had the chance to dig in a little bit, um, basically this is a uh, ramen that comes with some pork and then the egg, as you can see, and it's got uh, green onions in it. I am not a ramen connoisseur, so I'm not sure what the uh, little darker pieces are, but overall I'm pretty satisfied uh, with the ramen. Not the cheapest ramen you can get in Tokyo. Definitely not the best ramen you can get in Tokyo. Um, but I still really like it, and I like uh, the experience of having all of the Kaguya-sama characters around me and stuff. So, yeah, honestly, definitely worth it. For the ramen, I paid about 1,200 yen, so um, a little less than 12 US dollars. But overall, honestly, it's pretty filling, so I'm definitely happy with that. No, I almost completely forgot to flip over my coaster to see which character I get, so here we go. His sister, I believe. She's not in the anime very much. Maybe she'll have a bigger role in the second season, so it took me a while to figure out who this was, but uh, I actually like this coaster quite a bit. It's uh, kind of got a more laminated feel, um, and some of them are more of a matte feel, so I kind of like this quite a bit. Here's the Kaguya Cafe store. It's actually shared with a few other anime items such as Idol Master on this side and uh, some other things on that side. Oh, actually I understand. So this is um, Bungo Stray Dogs um, and they must have had a cafe here and then there's just leftover things from that cafe here. I really like the lottery. The lottery thing is you pay like a certain amount of yen. It's usually, oh here we go, 650 yen. 650 yen and you get to draw a prize and the biggest prize is the Kaguya pillow and then you can see there's a bunch of other smaller prizes as well. I really think these are the cutest. These are really adorable and they have them dressed up as little cafe maids. That's awfully fitting. And then down here you can draw a random character button and acrylic keychains. Ah, and this is a, another lottery item, little bento box. How cute is that, honestly? All right, guys, I'm in the elevator going back down to Akihabara. I think that the cafe was okay. I did enjoy it, however. However, I think I was expecting a little bit more, but it makes sense because there was another anime series that was in the cafe, and it kind of pushed the Kaguya-sama stuff to the side. 
I think because it's kind of at the end of the cafe's cycle, they're just like running out of things maybe is why they push it aside. However, the food was really good and I enjoyed the atmosphere and I like that it's Kaguya Samba. It's, you know, not the most popular show, popular anime. So I'm happy that there's at least something for it. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will play with you some other time.